So I started when Contagious Scotland started, I think it was about eight years ago now, and did three years there. Took a little break and then went back last year uh, as a leader for my first time leading. So good to be back. I went for thorough biblical goodness. I really enjoy the seminars and I think that's probably because it's something that you don't really get in many other places. It feels like very different to a church sermon. You go really deep scanning over the whole Bible. I think, yeah, it's one of the big highlights. It's always in the middle of the day when you're flagging a little bit, but you're gassed up on sugar um, and yeah, always a really good time. So yeah, I think the seminars are the thing I look forward to most. Uh, every year there's always a lot of four square. It's just something we always enjoy and I look forward to it. If you're not being contagious and know what I'm talking about, there's another reason to go. The four square it's always quality. The last year we did the church, um, so thinking about um, being a member of a church, what does the church actually mean? Um, but it also came at a time where I was thinking a lot about like the church generally myself, and so I was going into it with questions that had completely like unrelated to contagious. And as I was doing my leaders prep, um, all these questions were being answered. So um, it was a timely series for me, and yeah, loved it. Really good and really practical for thinking about serving and what the church looks like. Thinking about this, I think it's one of the places which takes young people most seriously or is most obvious about that um, and just really not underestimating how much capacity these young people have for learning um, and making the most of that by giving them as much of the gospel and as much like, good truth as they can. Um, I think it's rare and I think it's something that the church would really benefit from longer term if more people did it. So I just love how seriously they take the young people. Um, I think for the same reason as I just said before, that it takes the young people seriously and I think it's good for the church long term and so I want to be involved in something which will be building up the church and the kind of thing that will keep it healthy going into the future by giving these young people a good solid doctrinal foundation that they can take forward as they grow up.